just uh, want to jump on here and say I hope you enjoy my get ready with me video that I shot this morning it's just a quick little video on how I do my makeup when I'm in a hurry and I want to get out of the house fast and I did show you a lot of my new favorite products that I've been using every day even when I'm you know have time to to do my makeup and I'm not in a rush so I just wanted I'll go over some of them really quick that I've been using and absolutely in love with and first off would be this foundation the wet and wild cushion foundation is phenomenal it is super cheap you could buy it in the drugstore i think i got mine at rite aid and i use the color 107a it's cream ivory and i absolutely love this product it goes on very light um you can build it up and you'll see in the video i do kind of build it up in certain areas but it gives your skin a very natural look so it's not cakey, it doesn't settle into my creases or lines or anything. I've really been loving it. I've been using this now for maybe a couple weeks. In fact, I like it so much, I already have another one just in case I, I run out. Um, other than that, let's see, what else did I use that I'm really obsessed with? Well, I've been using this guy for probably since the summer. It's the Born This Way concealer. This stuff is the best concealer out there, but that's not new. I've been using that guy for a while. Um, eye pencils. I always tight line my eyes, my waterline on the bottom with a black pencil. I just can't, it just, I'm so used to it, I can't not have it done, I guess. I don't know. It just seems to work for my eye shape and my eye color. I have darker eyes to begin with, so I always do black on my bottom waterline. And I've really been liking the, the um, Eye Sense by Cinegens. It is a long-lasting eyeliner pencil and it really does last. It doesn't smudge off underneath my eyes. I don't get that goop in the corner from it. I will also um, tight line my upper lash line when I'm doing my wing with this stuff and it's really good. It does last all day. So I've been using this now, I wanna say since October. And I'll show you, I did draw it on my hand in the video to show you what the nice pigment is, such a nice pretty black. But look it, it really doesn't come off. That's the blush which you'll also see from the video. Pink blush, pick a clean finger. That finger's clean, right? <laughs> see, doesn't smudge, it's great. So now onto the blush that you see has my little finger stained here because I didn't wipe it off yet, is the blush, blush Sense from the Cinegens. This stuff is pretty good too because you need a, just a tiny little dot and a little goes a long way. I love blush. I'm a blush girl. I think everybody needs to wear a little bit of blush because it brightens up the cheek, puts a little life into your face. I've always done it. I'll find plenty of blushes that I like and I put it on. I'm like, this looks great. And two, three hours later, I'm like, where'd it go? It's gone. So I started researching a little on some cream and liquid blushes. And so far, this is the only one that I like. It's not thick. It doesn't rub off my foundation that's underneath it. It's very easy to blend. And you'll see in the video, I use a teeny tiny little amount, very, very small amount of this. And this will last me all day. If I need it to last an extra long time, I might do this and then top it off with another blush that's a little bit similar in color to make it last a little bit longer. But this stuff is great. And you could see, I dotted it on my hand and then I use my finger to kind of tap it and blend it with a brush. But you could see there's the, the color right there. It's a very light pink color. This color that I'm using is actually chocolate cherry. So um, I would say that's probably the most, um, oh, the mascara. I just started using this one, guys. This is the Lash Sense by Cenogens. I've been really trying out the Cenogens products lately. There's a, they're really blowing up on uh, YouTube, on the Instagram, so I'm curious to try them out. And I'm trying this. It is Lash Sense, and it's a volume intense mascara. And I use black, obviously. This does come in waterproof. I don't do waterproof. I don't feel that I really need it at this time of year, the waterproof. But um, I've been using it. So far, I like it. Um, I'm not sure if it's going to replace my go-to yet, my go-to Thrive mascara, but um, I'm using it and I'm going to definitely give it a good good um, trial to, before I make my decision. Um, the one thing that I'm not crazy about is the wand. When you take it out the first time, you get a, kind of a lot of buildup here on the, on the end, so you have, really have to make sure you scrape that off or 
you're gonna end up with really clumpy, messy lashes. And somebody like me, I have really fine, short lashes. I can't have any extra product or it'll just look clumpy. But you could see, get up and close and personal with you. This is my look for today to head out, run some errands and get my stuff done. And I just wanna wish you all a great and happy Sunday and smile. I'll see you soon.